Welcome back to Fire Emblem 7. Greetings, Rawson fans. How goes it? How's your day? Uh, thanks for all the views on uh, Chapter 1, or the prologue or whatever. Uh, just uploaded that. The rest of them are on their way, obviously. It's going to be a couple days before I really see it, so that's why I'm so far behind. I mean, it's not that far behind. It's just like doing Chapter 8, and we're talking about Chapter 1. Uh, I don't know. But uh, either way, I appreciate it. It's pretty cool to see uh, some views on the on an old game that's very dear to my heart or whatever. So, yeah, um, had a lot of impressions on that video, and uh, it's pretty cool to see. Passing through Arafin and Catholic, Lynn and her friends arrive in Caelan. However, Caelan is now under the rule of Lord Lundgren. Lundgren's henchmen lay in wait to assassinate Lynn. They wait for her approach and ready a special weapon. Chapter 8 Vortex of Strategy See, there's no music this time. I was waiting for it, but this is a quiet, eerie, weird day. Look, Jib, the mountain seems so far away now. We've come such a long way. Lady Lindis, Jib. We can't be very far from the castle now. By my reckoning, we can reach Castle Caelan in two days if we hurry. Two more days. Hold on, Grandfather. Please. Cheer up, Lynn. If they, see you, <laughs> if they see you looking so sad, the entire company will lose heart. Florina, you're right. There's nothing to be gained by worrying. We just have to press onward. That's the spirit. Lynn, danger approaches. What did you say? I don't see anything. Are you sure? I feel it too. I'm sure of it. Ah! Milady, don't move! Hmm? Well, does that count towards one of the five shots? What? In, where did this bolt come from? They have a ballista. Lord Lundgren is getting serious. Deploying siege engines is no mean feat. What is a ballista? It's a weapon designed for long distance attacks. Only archers can use them, but they can be devastating. Florina, you must stay aground. Do not take to the air. The ballista would target you in an instant. Is there a way to combat it? The safest course is to use someone with good defense as bait, so the enemy wastes arrows. Then you can walk up and knock the fool in the head. Will, can you use a ballista? I've never tried, but it's just a really big bow, right? I should be able to figure it out. All we can ask is that you try. Let's see what we can do. Ah, Lady Lindis, uh, I have some minor business to attend to. I'm unable to join you. If you need any of my possessions, please take them now. Um, what is the point of that? I always just remember it being a thing. But why does that happen? Is there an actual reason that's not just story related for no reason? <laughs> Um, cause he's obviously doing some spy work, right? So, but what is he doing? Um, I don't, I don't know. I don't remember. Is he going to see Layla or something? Who knows? Um, well, pfft, yeah, right. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess we'll just take, take that cause trying to mitigate, you know, the, uh, the extra hands on deck, if you will. I don't really know why, but just happening. Guess I don't need sane either. And we gotta figure out what to do with this angelic robe. Part of me wants to put it on Sarah, but like, are we actually even gonna use Sarah? I'm not sure. Part of me wants to use it on Lucius, but are we gonna really use Lucius? I don't know, he's kinda good. See, it's like, Lynn is so freaking frail that, I uh, mean, <laughs> it's easy to want to play on her. Um, Florina sees so many more fights, you know what I mean? I think we're just gonna put it on Lynn. 
Is this a bad idea? It normally ends out ends up pretty well, right? I mean, with all the with all the lances he's gonna take to the face in the later part of the game, it'll be worth it probably. And I don't have anyone who can use a hammer, so not yet at least. Pure water. I mean, I don't know. Maybe we'll just keep that on uh, on Kent, but. Kent's got a lot of weapons all of a sudden. Not really. Bow, bow. Might as well, right? Alright, let's stop horsing around, shall we? Sane does not need to be here either. And Florina can honestly probably be okay well, we can let's see here let's, let's do some damage calcing actually 14 and we'll double this guy right four speed bringing down to six actually we might not yeah we're not we're not going to oh no we're with the 11 times two it's not gonna do it so that's okay we can uh drink a pure water actually we can <laughs> put the pure water on her this is like so much extra nonsense to be doing that does not need to be done but we're gonna do it anyway uh shoot might as well might as well just do it right i don't know all right, um, let's see here. Kent, put Kent, no, maybe do a little bit of that. Uh, I don't think we need anything really from the armory. Um, maybe a bow, but I don't think we do, to be honest. Da, 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 da. I don't think we do. We're good on swords. Everybody's got a lot of swords. We got plenty of lances, so I think we're okay as long as we can find a lightning someday soon. Ba -da -ba. Ba -ba -boo -boo -ba -da -do. I think we're just gonna go here with Nils. Ba -da -da -ba 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 because we don't really need to dance for Florina, really. So it's kind of a waste of whatever that was. But that's all right. If we can get out of his range, that would be nice, but I don't think we can. Ba -da -da -da, ba -da -da -da. Ba -ba. Ba -ba. Something about Lin's mode, man. Probably just because I've played it five million times when I was a kid. And like I mentioned in one of the earlier chapters, I didn't think the game went past level chapter 19, so it's like this is half of the game to me for a long time. Ba -ba -da -da. How does it only do six? That's what I want to know. And are we going to double this guy? No. We need another level up. Maybe we can. Maybe we can double this guy, though. Burr. Something I think about sometimes is like my Fire Emblem Let's Plays. Over the years have been a lot of... Hmm, that was a bad level up. That was an X level up. You know, like, insert commentary here. <laughs> And uh, singing to the battle music, you know. What else do you want me to do? Hmm? Oh, we do kill him. Oh, well, duh, slow, the freaking thing slows him down like a ton. Uh, <laughs> he's so weak. We'll just we'll just do this. We don't even need to worry about it. Burning around. 
Honestly, we should be getting Wrath level ups, but I feel like Lucius is going to be a little harder to train when we get him back. And he is a uh, harder time leaving the enemies uh, low because of the magic and speed. But also, he's got limited lightning, so we should probably keep that in mind as well. And there we go, there's defense. Pfft, he's fine. <laughs> you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean, man? See, look at that uh, 10 HP to the face. That would have meant a lot more if uh, she only had 21 HP. I mean, it's only marginally better, right? But she can survive an extra hit that way. Which is pretty important, I would say. I would venture to say. Ba -da -ba. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba. And we can just heal you. Why not? Oops, I had skipped the dialogue. What a buffoon I am. Ba -da -da -ba 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 -da -ba. Very good. The Manny Caddy is kind of broken. Just like what we, uh, that's what we want to see. Who's the archer gonna go for? That's what I want to know. Probably Farina. Duh. Do -do 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 -do. And is this? Oh no, that that village is the land tree. Right? That's right. I was gonna say, is it another pure water? But no, it's actually a good item. Oh, he doesn't go for Lin or. <laughs> Florina, which is interesting. You'd think they'd want to go for effective damage, but maybe you couldn't get there for some reason. Ba -ba -da 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 -da. All right, let's get back up into this village. Do you remember the weapon triangle? Axes over lances and whatnot. This is important, so pay attention. There are some weapons that don't follow the more normal rules. This here lance reaver is one of those. It is a sword that reverses the triangle, so if you wield this blade, you can best a lance with it. Of course, there's a downside. Axes can best this sword. Take this as a gift. It's your reward for listening to an old man ramble. Don't be so shy. It's not like I can use the thing. Not everyone can wield a sword of this caliber. I'm sure you know who someone can use know someone who can use it though. Uh yes. Oops, we are full. Let's get a let's get rid of the iron lance. We don't need it. We've got plenty, but also we don't need the pure water. We might need it. Let's get rid of the vulnerary, because I know we've got plenty of those. Ba da di da bia ba ba ha ba di do. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. This has to happen. Well, well. I should be training Wrath because you get him a lot later. Let's solo the solo the rest of the game with Wrath. Might as well. Sane doesn't even need to move. Ah, they're rushing me. And this is a sword reaver? No, this is normal. I felt the crit right there for some reason. I don't know why, but I knew it was coming. I knew it. I knew it. Alright. What kind of damage is this guy gonna do? 12? No. Oh, please. Oh, please. Ah, uh, yes. Ba da ba ba. Whoa, reinforcements. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ouch. <clears throat> I 
feel like it's a Raven type of playthrough. Don't you think? I feel like we, uh, we need that. For some reason. Oh my goodness. That's a fantastical crit right there. Ooh, we actually can't do much damage here. ba 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 just gonna do a little switcheroo, then we're just gonna do a little do -si do There we go. Better it up. Better it up. All right, so obviously the gimmick with this chapter, I failed to even talk about it. What's my problem? Gimmick with this chapter is the the Reaver weapons, right? <clears throat> so these are all going to be backwards in the weapon triangle, including Yogi, the boss, who's just a pitiful little knight who's pretty strong, kind of tanky, but with a with Lin's special weapon, it's like pretty pretty darn trivial, really. Um, and I didn't mean to move her that far, but that's fine. Might as well. And Lucius might mop up all these kills, actually, which, you know, give him another level. It's, that's probably fine. Why not? <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> without that extra point of defense, he could have died right there if both of those hit him. Which would be very embarrassing. Okay, kind of like that level up. But now we can use Shine, so that's fine. Oh, he's gonna go for Kent. Get darn, damn near one shot. Damn near one shot it. Ba ba ba. Sort of was thinking about promoting Kent this this uh, in Lin's mode. I don't know. <clears throat> I don't know about that yet. Um. I might just sell the Knight's Crest. Double check, see if I, uh, how the the uh, red gem, the gems work going into Elder Woods. Not really sure on that, so might need to double check it. But uh, it's something about like the more money you make or have at the end of the lens mode, uh, the more the more money in gems you will get. Uh, when you get her back, so uh, I mean I don't know. And see, this is what I mean. It's just like a absolutely a cakewalk here. And especially if you do this, I mean that's even you know Kent's, <laughs> which maybe I should do that. But Lynn can use a level as well, and and Kent doesn't really need the help. But maybe we could baby this thing and um, <clears throat> do a little chip damage, and then Wrath can get a kill here. Yeah, it looks like we can do that. So maybe, just maybe, we'll, we will do that. And Lucius could just about kill him, dude. Curses! The ballista must have been taken. What's going on here? Somebody get that girl! Yeah, yeah, right, man. So we're just gonna um, fast forward through that a little bit, if you don't mind. And we're gonna get some more healing in. And, uh... Yeah. Da, 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 da. So she's close to level, and Wrath will be able to get this kill. And maybe get a level himself. Lord Lundgren, I've failed you. I pray you hurry with those reinforcements you promised. Well, I don't know if he's coming to save you, but it's been nice knowing you, Yogi. And strength is not bad, okay? Strength is not bad, Wrath, but. <clears throat> we could see that your levels get a little better. Is it over? Yes, I see no it. See no more enemy soldiers. However, something is bothering me. What is it? I noticed it during the fighting. Our opponents. They were soldiers of Kalen. I even recognized some of those who we fought. I trained with many of them. And yet they attacked us without hesitation. They're black-hearted traitors who've joined Lundgren. 
Good riddance, I say. It also means less resistance at the castle. I hope you're right. <clears throat> I'm just glad Nils and Ninian were with us. If that first shot had hit me, I might not have survived. We are honored to ha we have we're honored to have served you well. We won't let you down. I know. I'm relying on you. What's this? You dealt with the ballista too? Nicely done. Matthew, where were you during all this? I went to the village to sniff out sniff about for some information. I got some interesting news for my trouble too. Let's hear it. Alright, well that's where it was. <laughs> First, about Marquis Kalen's illness. He really is un really is unwell. He's been abed for nigh on three months. Oh no, grandfather. I heard an interesting rumor about his condition though. People believe that someone's been poisoning the Marquis. He's been being poisoned? And this someone, well everyone's too afraid to mention a name. However, they say that as soon as the Marquis took ill, a certain noble took control of the castle as though it were his own. I fed a hungry innkeeper some coin and he fed me a name. The Marquis of Caelan's own brother, Lord Lundgren. How can this be? How can they allow him to get away with this? The villagers know he's the one poisoning my grandfather, and yet no one raises a hand against him? Why? They are afraid and lack proof. The whisperings of the common people means nothing. That's the truth of it. And the Marquis's loyal retainers, who might have led credence to these rumors, there's no sign. I read that completely wrong. Are you saying they've been they've been silenced? It's a fair assumption. This is beyond believing. The worst news is yet to come. What? There's more? An imposter appeared, claiming to be the Marquis's granddaughter. At least, that's the story Lundgren's telling to all who'll listen. What does that mean? It means that people are waiting for two traitorous knights and a baseborn child to appear and laid claim to Castle Caelan. But, but that, it can't be. Traitors? Us? Ridiculous. He says, I'm an imposter? Don't you have anything that proves your line lineage? When my mother joined the Lorca, she brought nothing of Lycia with her. Lady, Marquis Arafin himself remarked at your resemblance to Lady Madeline. Your face is your proof. We'll say we found a look-alike somewhere. We're seen as betrayers of our knightly vows. Our word means nothing. No, our only hope is to see Mar Ka Marquis Caelan himself. We must hurry. If not, my grandfather... I must see him, with my last breath if need be. We must formulate some manner of plan. Even if we set out for the castle, these troops patrolling the area will cause no end of problems. You've been branded as, as oath-breakers, after all. I've got it. Etherwood. He seems sympathetic to our plight. He should still be in Cathlet. If we can talk to him, he might help us. Of course, a sound idea. Let's hurry. Yes, back to Cathlet. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. And that's been it for Chapter 8. Nice and short and sweet, I guess. Been playing a lot of Andron Saga, or not a lot of, but been used to those chapters taking me like two hours in total with dialogue and everything. So it's kind of a nice treat, but I know it doesn't last for long. <laughs> All right, we're going into chapter nine a grim reunion. <clears throat> Lynn and her friends have been branded as traitors, pretenders to the throne. Lundgren has sent word to Caitlin's neighbors, warning them of Lynn's approach. He calls for reinforcements to put an end to the imposters. If the, others, if the other realms of Lycia choose to act, Lynn will never reach Caelan alive. Lynn places her faith in Elliwood and waits. Chapter 9 A Grim Reunion Oh, what a glorious sound Elliewood's theme is. <sighs> -da -da -da. I'm just gonna admit, just gonna listen for a minute because it's been a minute. <sighs> I've received word from Kalen's neighbors, Laos, Toscana, Toscana. That's like Italian, sounds like. To Toscana, Catholic. Tania, 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 and Santa Cruz. They will not interfere in Kaelin's affairs. They've this they have promised. Elliewood, I don't know how to thank you. All I've done is convince them to remain neutral in this dispute. However, this means I cannot aid you in any way either. Will you be all right? I will win. I have to. 
It's the only way I can help my grandfather. I understand. Although I cannot help you directly, as a friend, I pray for you. Pray for your success. Thank you. I won't waste the opportunity you've given me. Uh... All right, everyone. Let's get going. This weather is turning foul. Looks like a fog is rolling in. This is no good. If the fog, thi fog thickens, we'll be blind in battle. It'll be difficult to fight what we cannot see. We can't let it delay us, though. Let's press on. Let us press on. We must get closer to the castle. What's the best route? Let me think. Our best path is to the south. However, that runs through General Eagler's estate. It looks like we still have one final obstacle to pass. Okie dokie, we're gonna get ready for chapter 9. Take a look at it really quick, though. So we start off in this little canyon area right here, and there's a village. Gives you a torch, I believe, and a fort that respawns some enemies. And this map isn't really huge, but it feels kind of big once you get um, the fog coming in. Or at least it did back in the day. Now it's <laughs> not really this, this uh, case, but... This is General Eagler. He's uh, he's the boss of the chapter. Obeys Lundgren, Lundgren's orders. And he's a paladin. He's our first, like, tier 2 unit we find. And he's not very over... Uh, he's not very great, I guess. He's got pretty high defense for, for this point in the game. And the fact that he's got a javelin and a hand axe means he's going to basically find the better edge of the weapon triangle for him in enemy phase, but you can kind of uh, get around it a little bit <clears throat> here and there when he's switching back and forth, obviously, and we've got these guys who are guarding him, pretty much <laughs> walking uh, walls, not walls, paper. Zero defense, look at these, Th zero stats, except for a little bit of strength and a little bit of speed, just so, I don't know. If you have a, a, a rescued, uh, uh, like a Urk rescued a Nils, you can't double him or something. I don't know. <clears throat> and then there will be a lot more reinforcements coming in on this area. So once the fog sets in, uh, you'll be in for that. And there's another spot here, another spot here, another spot here that some brigands will come out of. And so let's set it up, shall we? I think we're going to get rid... Well, we could bring Urk, Matthew... Sane, maybe, I guess. Just bring the whole gang. Might as well. I don't see Dorcas being so useful because I don't really think I want to use Dorcas. Part of me does. But part of me realizes that uh, it's always usually for naught. <laughs> like, I don't know. He <laughs> He's just so bad. If we give him all the speed, ring speed wings, maybe he'd be okay. But probably not. So... What we're going to do is just bring everybody else, basically. And Lucius has seven lightnings left, so that's unfortunate. Really uh, ticking down his usefulness. And it kind of sucks because he gets totally screwed over in that regard. As um, nobody else really has limited weapons but him, which is kind of weird. Alright, so another lance. Kind of just full on lances, so might as well just give it away to him. Give this to Florina. Ba ba da ba. Ba ra ba ba ba. Okay, I think we're ready. Just gonna place where we uh, wanna be here. I think you can go there. I think you can go there. I think. I think I might have Sane just kind of... I don't know. I don't know. Duh. Da -da. <laughs> and Kent will be here. Florina will be here. Wrath will come down here. I think we'll do something like that. Alright. Let's get into it. Chip, put me in the lead, please. Surely you know that er, we are er, uh, thieves, if you must, can see through fog. Follow me, everyone. Oh, <laughs> almost forgot. So you've come. Ah, 
You, your Lord Wallace. Kent, who is this? He used to be the commander of the knights in Kaelin. Aren't you supposed to be retired? I heard you were sowing fields now. I am, and I was. Then I received orders from Lord Lundgren. I was to capture an imposter and a pair of rogue knights. Lord Wallace, surely you don't believe us to be Oathbreakers, do you? Bring me the girl that claims to be Mad Lady Madeline's child. What are your intentions? If I don't like what I see, I will take her. We will prevent you. You? Prevent me? You must be... Enough. I'm right here. I am Lindis. Ah. I'll understand you if you don't believe me. But I've had enough of you and your foolish posturing. Hmm. Such beautiful eyes. Pardon? I've been a knight for 30 years, and there is one thing I learned. A person with eyes as bright as true as, and true as yours is no deceiver. <laughs> yes, I like you, girl. Why? I believe I'll even join your little band of mercenaries. Are you... are you serious? This old bull's pledged his loyalty to Kaelin. I would never I would never allow an usurper, usurper, I always struggle with this one, on the throne. Let's march. Lord Wallace, he... he hasn't changed at all. I like him. He's honest. That he is. He deserves our respect. Okay. Here's Wallace. He's actually kind of... Is he this good on normal mode? Did he get hard mode bonuses? No. Did he? I don't know. But this is actually kind of good. These are good base stats, really. Um, so, you know, retired Knight of Kaelin constantly testing himself. And I really want to like Wallace. And in, in the beginning, it's like, he's insane because he's the first unit you can promote with a Knight's Crest here and turn him into a general, which is, you know, same tier as the Paladin over here, Eagler. And he gets a bunch of stat boosts and he can use the Iron Axe, which really helps him get through Eagler basically later on and then again L uh, Lundgren. And without him, it's kind of a struggle. But the thing is, I think Kent could... <laughs> I honestly think Kent can take him on here with the Armor Slayer and uh, do okay because he double him. And do some effective damage there. Wouldn't be a ton of damage. It'd be like what, 16, 27. It'd be like 27. It'd be like 12 damage times two. I mean, that's pretty good. You could almost, you could two round him, I guess, Kent. But he also would take some damage. I'm basically just saying when he was saying you take me, I mean, it'd be a close one. It really would. If Sane's in there, he might be able to do a little bit. <laughs> might be able, be able to do a little bit of damage. Probably not. Anyways. Not important. Um, Wallace. I don't think we're going to promote him here. We could maybe try to promote Kent. But I don't think that's going to happen either. Just because I want a little little more time in the Cavalier class with him. And uh, I can always wait. And so basically we're going to visit this village here. It's not important what they say. They give us a torch. And that will be nice for later on. And so... Yeah, <laughs> think we're gonna just snag that. We're gonna have Nils dance for us. Part of me wants to use Matthew a little bit, but I don't think that's really necessary because whenever I do that, it's not really worth it a whole lot, if that makes any sense. <clears throat> but I don't know, we can try at some point, I guess. <clears throat> I pretty much just have another setup for this map, too. There's probably better ways to do it, but this is the way I've always kind of done it, so this is the way you're gonna freaking kind of get it, you know what I mean? I don't know. Da, 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 da. We're gonna change this one up a little bit just because it's a little bit uh, harder to. Whoa, those are ambush spawns, aren't they? That's kind of mean. I mean,. It's never going to kill you, probably. There's no way you really will die on the first turn. Just one reinforcement like that. But it's kind of crazy that it's a thing, right? It did not know that. So... 
So basically the strat is wait a little bit further off so they can stop getting terrain bonuses. Um, so yeah, I mean, kind of want to just move up the, f the, the units. So and uh, get a little bit, I think we might just bench Luchas basically for this chapter until maybe we need him up here. Um, I don't know because what I might do is throw Sane right here with the sword, take this hit for the other ranged unit, which is <laughs> essentially Urk at this point. So maybe what I just said was is not true. And uh, <laughs> don't worry, I'm good at what I do. Okay. Might as well. Matthew needs a little bit. A little bit of work. And he'll get good experience from these, so that'll be fine. Da da. Seventeen percent, really? That's crazy, actually. Da da da. Maybe we will just have Lucius tank these hits. I don't. I don't really know. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Oops, didn't mean to speed up here. Or there, but it's kind of necessary, I guess. I mean, it's not really, but... <clears throat> Whatever. Ba -ba -ba -ba. And that hurts. That's a big ouch right there. That's a big one. A big ouchies. Da, 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 da. Chip. The fog's rolling in. We can't hit an enemy we can't see. Keep your eyes open, everyone. Alright, so... No matter. Because what we can do is haphazardly come out here and with our vulnerable units, even though I did not need to go that far. We can heal Matthew. Send him into the into the <laughs> into the darkness with this torch, and then be on our merry way. Go a little bit backwards. Have to maybe take one out with Oswin. Oswin, Wallace, and it'll be okay, you know. And Sarah's gonna get some good level ups actually, which is, you know, to be expected, I guess. Ba -da 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 -da. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba Dum, 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 dum. Wallace will be king of the chip damage, which is really what we need here. Soften him up. Uh, speaking of, we get a crit. That's not what I was meaning to say, but works out. And so, trying to remember where the shop on the final chapter is. I think there's one right in the like in the spawn, so that's that part is good but I am a little concerned that we he might be a, like kind of useless <laughs> for part of the chapter which I guess is just it is what it is right <clears throat> could have optimized it a little better but we're not trying to like min max lin mode you know ba -da -da -da. Ba -da 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 -da. I need to grind Kent's uh, Lance mode. Lance mode? Lance rank. So, we're gonna do some Iron Lance. Get the 8 experience kill. Wow. Yeah, it's kind it's really unfortunate how slow the levels get, but 8 levels in Lin mode is pretty pretty good. We can't, we can't ask for too much, right? And like, that's B rank. That's Brave Bow with Wrath, and he can... I think he's a Brave Bow in the chapter he joins back in, so... I mean, that's nice. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. And we probably should be using a Slim Lance here. So we don't... We can have a better chance of dodging these. Da -da 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 -da. Bum, 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 bum.
And then the next level up would be really nice to get some strength because you might start one rounding these guys with an iron sword because it's probably close to breaking. But we don't need that, we just need luck and resistance instead, of course. It'd be kind of cool to see Lin have a better ref uh, resistance because it's kind of like her another one of her many weak po points. It's like low HP, low low strength, low uh, defense and resistance. Like maybe a little bit of magic res like would be nice because even a freaking thunder is annoying later from the game for her because it's like I don't know. Does just as much as a freaking lance to the face, practically. Anywho, um, let's see. Ba ba wow 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 wow. I think uh, I think Matthew deserves a little bit of a level here, or I don't know if it'll give him a level, but. Maybe we go back and take this guy down. Oh, it definitely will. What can he get? Speed defense? I'm not going to complain about that. Not going to complain. Alright, so Fire Emblem fans, now that we're 50 minutes in, 40 minutes in, what other games are you playing these days? I kind of have a all-over-the-place taste. I got a lot of shooters in my library. I've been playing the finals lately. It's pretty fun with the friends. Um, Overwatch and Call of Duty is kind of a mainstay for me as of late. Um, haven't really dove into much else. Past that, I mean, a little bit of Starfield here and there. Um, but I wanted to like get into something more solo. And every time I have extra time, I am probably pretty much playing Fire Emblem. So I don't know. Still haven't been engaged, so that's been my like nighttime thing. And uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Just curious what other people are playing. I know there's like a lot of hot games out now. Like Baldur's Gate. I never really was into something of that type. At least I think. I don't know. Something about it just makes me not super inclined to play. want to play. Stuff like uh, Cyberpunk is intriguing. Just never got around to it. I did finally buy it on sale. So maybe someday soon. And, and things like that are, are games that I've been interested to record. It's just like my content is so split up. It's like I don't know how to have all the time and energy for it. And to do multiple channels is stupid. And it kind of just makes me not want to do it in general. But alas, I digress. Don't want to be an entire segment. But it's like I want to find the balance, you know. To find the balance and not find like the bottleneck to where I'm like doing a whole bunch of nothing basically does that make sense I don't know if it is but uh, yeah I guess it's time we uh, start moving everybody up here in a minute but we could do like well ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 Wallace and uh, Wrath come up this way, maybe? I don't know what's better. Wrath isn't going to be able to do much to Eagler. Kent's almost level, what is that, 9? Yep. Matthew could sort of do it, not quite, but I'm just going to throw him here, see what happens. Wrath coming for this kill. And I guess we'll have a... 
I think we'll spend one more turn over here and then have Florina kind of carry lane across the map. I don't know. Did I just leave Nils open? I might have. That's alright though, honestly. He should be able to tank it. If he took a Ballista to the face and only took 6 damage, he's probably okay. Although the Ballista's there to not be overpowered and, you know. Oh, left Sarah open. That's okay. Okay, so... Is he getting anywhere? He might not be. That's fine. As long as somebody useful is getting those kills, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's just like, I don't want to be wasting the tome more than I have to, but what else are we going to do? What are we going to do, right? Ba, 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 ba. Actually, that might be a good Matthew kill. Wrath. Could make his way over there. Oh, he can't make it. So this will be fine. Although I could have danced for him, that's true. Oh well, it's not big, not big of a deal. How does how do we fare over here, Kent? Not the best. Sixteen, and then. Going up to 17 and then to 18. So it would be 11 with the axe, right? With the weapon triangle. Da, 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 da. Should be fine. Sorry about that. <laughs> Just to be safe. We'll throw a little bit of healing your way. Not, uh, it's never a bad idea to get some healing experience in. Kent, is that you? General Eagler, we found Lady Lindis on the orders of the Marquis. We've worked so very hard to return her to safely to Kaelin, and yet you have no proof of the girl's identity. Is that not true? Yes, but then our talk is finished. Draw your weapon and come. Okay. So set in his ways. And he misses. This is like the most experience Kent's gotten in a long time. Ironically, that was not a great level, but HP. Not mad about HP. Not mad about that one. Da 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 da. And here's the axe. Hit rate's gone down, but we should be able to poke him again, still. Okay. Sane might get a level up here, actually. Maybe next turn. It's kind of a, it's kind of a cider and kind of nervous. <laughs> Uh, don't listen to me. Okay. Just gonna one shot him? Yes. Bum 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 bum. And what shall we do? What do you mean, what shall we do? We shall shoot him again. And eight experience. That's kind of crazy. All right, we got the last guy on the map. Oops, I almost hit. Uh, sure, go ahead and battle. Go ahead and fight. That would have sucked. But I had to restart because I misclicked and killed Kent. 
That really would have sucked. Really would have sucked. Alright. Meanwhile, he's gonna heal up, surely, slowly, but surely. Bung, bada, bung, bada, bung, bada, bung. Da, 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 da. Oh, he hit me. Not very nice. I could get Lin to get this kill, but sort of want Kent to get it. Unless Wrath can. I doubt it. We could try. Probably be inaccurate. Might be very little damage. Well, you will just have to see what he can do. Okay, sorry for that. Oh, he does three. Interesting. Better, 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 better. you look at that? He still goes for Kent. Miss. Probably shouldn't try to spend all day fighting Eagler. <laughs> but it's kind of tempting to just, uh, you know, cheese it. Imposters to the throne, you shall not pass. No quarter for traitors. Yes, thank you. Goodbye. Oh, he missed. Okay. Should we just? <laughs> I was gonna dance for. I was gonna dance for Sarah, but okay. Been waiting for this short bow critical for forever, and he just won't do it. It's like he refuses. It's like, wait, I can crit? Nah, I don't need to do that. I don't need to do that, man. No way. Is he gonna go for the axe, though? He is more damage, but less accurate. Oh, oops, I, f <laughs> I fast forward. <laughs> I fast forward through it. That's embarrassing. Okay, so as long as Wrath hits this, we can get him a level. And it's going to be a great one. It's going to be a freaking great one. Okay, it's seen better, but not, not bad. Not going to complain about more speed. But uh, now who do we give the next one to? Kent. Or Lin. I'm thinking Lin because it's just easier to get Kent levels. So. And I, I healed the wrong person again. But not like it really matters. We're just grinding experience at this point. So. We're going to go for it. Lin will do the deed. Bring forth the imposter who calls herself Lindis. She shall not pass beyond this place. I am Lindis. I am no pretender. I'd ask you to believe me, but your heart and mind seem set. Enough talk. Draw your sword. Yeah, um, he had no chance, Eagler. G go quickly. Marquis, he knows nothing of this. His life is... There's no illness, only poison. Please, for the Marquis, for all of Caitlin. Dang. And that's a full level right there. Up to level 10, that's pretty good. Oh, God, come on. <sighs> I mean... That's exactly what she would get. And... Obviously it is. Another Sarah level. And there we are. What kind of man was General Eagler? When Sane and I first became knights, he was our captain, our teacher. 
I think he must have known we were telling the truth. Why did he force the fight? Something must have... Lord Lundgren was exerting some hold on him. Eagler was trying to protect someone, a friend perhaps, or family. May Lundgren never know the peaceful embrace of Mother Earth. I care not what others do. I will stop that man. The final battle is approaching. Okay. Is it foggy here, or what's going on here in Castle Kale? It's still foggy way over there? I guess it's not that far away, right? Mm. How are you feeling today, my dear brother? Lundgren, you... you fiend. Your granddaughter is dead by now, and soon you will join her. Lindis, why did this happen? I only wanted to see her once. Have you lost all hope? Has your life lost all meaning? Then hurry up and die, you miserable old dotard. You and your precious granddaughter are in my way. I curse your name. I despise you, my worthless wretch of a brother. Okay. That's dramatic, Lord Lundgren. I'm sorry about that, but that's a little too far. All right. It's been a good chapter. Been a couple, a good couple chapters. And uh, should round it off for a nice chapter 10 of wrap up lens mode. And uh, yeah, I'm liking a little bit of a shorter time commitment here. It's nice. But uh, that will end someday soon on this game because things will get longer. But that's fine. That's expected. Okay. Thanks so much for watching. If you made it this far, it's great. Really appreciate that. And uh, we'll see you in the next one for chapter 10.